Hello, I'm Jennifer Krause and these are your News Channel 5 headlines. I-24 is back open after a deadly crash. At least three vehicles were involved, including a semi. This happened in the eastbound lanes near Briley Parkway and Harding Place in South Nashville around 1.30 this morning. One person died in that crash. The interstate was shut down for several hours while police investigated. Changes could be coming to your trash pickup service. Metro Public Works is conducting an audit now to make sure that trash and recycling services are doing what they're supposed to be. Policy says multifamily complexes with five or more units need a dumpster or compactor and are not eligible for curbside pickup. Metro Public Works says the audit became necessary because of Nashville's rapid growth. If your service is going to be changing, Public Works should let you know. Well, the gates are open at Bonnaroo or are, are opening at Bonnaroo in Manchester this evening for one of the biggest music festivals in the state. Traffic anchor Rebecca Schleicher has more on what you need to know if you are traveling to Coffee County. We know from years past that it gets very, very busy and congested along I-24 in Manchester during and before Bonnaroo. And we expect that again this year. In fact, if you need to head down to Chattanooga or the Atlanta area and you want to avoid the Bonnaroo traffic starting tonight and through the weekend, THP is recommending these massive detours to Atlanta. You can actually go down through Birmingham first to Chattanooga. You can go through Fayetteville over McMinnville or even up to Cookville and then down to the Chattanooga area to avoid that one stretch of I-24 in Coffee County. Now, if you are heading to Bonnaroo or you need to get to that area, here's a look at the map. They have several exits open to Bonnaroo festival goers. The main one, exit 111 right here in Orange to get to the farm. However, you've got exit 97, 105, a temporary 112 exit that they're bringing back in the westbound lanes again this year, 117 or 127 to get to Bonnaroo. Festival traffic needs to stay to the right shoulder or lane to hopefully let everyone else get by them. Be safe and have a good time. From the Five Live Traffic Center, I'm Rebecca Schleicher. All right, keeping our eye to the sky for one or two storms this afternoon. Now, here's the deal. Scattered showers and storms. Not everybody will see it, but of the storms that develop, one or two could be on the strong side. That chance a little greater in some of the eastern counties. Small hail and strong winds would be the concerns. There are damaging winds up to 50 miles per hour. Upper 70s to around 80. Temperatures below normal for the next several days. Normal high is about 85. Only mid 70s tomorrow. I'm meteorologist Cleveland Statham. Have a fantastic afternoon.